Well, hello there, guys. I have been asked by a bunch of people on how I live stream Procreate on my iPad on Twitch. So I thought I would make a little tutorial on how I set that up so that you can do the same. By the way, yes, I live stream on Twitch on Fridays and sometimes on Saturdays. On stream, I work on digital artwork, answer questions, and chat with viewers, and it would just be lovely to see you there sometime. Okay, let's get started. The first thing you're gonna have to do is download and install the software A PowerSoft iPhone slash iPad recorder. There are probably other software options out there for this, but this is the one I use and it works just fine. When you open the program, you will notice that it wants you to sign in and buy the software. If you are just streaming to OBS like we are here, then there's no need to do this. Just click the evaluate button. Now you'll be brought to this screen where it has pretty simple instructions on how to connect your device. Using the lightning USB cable, plug your iPad into your computer. Swipe to your menu that brings up the screen mirroring option. It's on the iPad. It's a weird, like little slow swipe down on a phone. It's a swipe up. I think, um, just get to get to this little menu and then tap the screen mirroring option and it should come up with the A PowerSoft option. Tap that option. Now what is on your iPad should be mirrored what's on the A PowerSoft software on your computer. So from here, open OBS. I'm using Streamlabs OBS, but regular OBS works fine too. Add a new source and make the source a window capture source. From the window dropdown, choose a PowerSoft iPhone recorder.exe. And it should give you a little preview here of your iPad. So now click done. Resize the window to whatever size you need for your streaming setup. And that's really it. It's pretty simple to set up, but I would recommend turning off the auto lock on your iPad when you're streaming. That way you won't be locked out and having to reconnect in the middle of the stream. That definitely happened to me the first time I tried streaming from my iPad. So learn from my mistakes and turn off the auto lock. I hope you found this little tutorial helpful. And if you did, make sure to give this video a like. If you are interested in seeing more art related videos and tips, subscribe to my channel and I will try and do more videos. If you're interested in seeing more of my artwork, please check out my Instagram, Twitter, and you can catch me live on Twitch on Fridays and sometimes Saturdays. Happy streaming. Oh, I hope you have a lovely time. Oh, you guys, this is so good. I hope you have a lovely time in this here channel of mine. Wow, I made a rhyme.